Guys, today I will teach you this incredible snack. Here I have ham and cheese slices. I make a tower like this. And I made this tower by adding one slice of ham, one slice of cheese until it gets to the top. Here it's important to get the ham on top. Now let's cut it in the half like this. And guys, it's very important to get the ham on top of each part because when you're going to fly, it can explode, okay? So I'm going to show you how it is in the inside. Let's go. Let's open it like this. And look, in the inside we have all this ham and cheese. And it's important to pressure like this. Now, let's split these parts in two. And as I told you, it's important to have ham and in the other part, ham too. Here, as you can see, we have ham and cheese, but we are going to cover the cheese with the ham, like this. Very easy, very fast, okay? Now, guys, I'm going to repeat this process with all the other part. We are going to split in the half and then cover it with ham. Okay, let's go. Okay, so here I have the other part. I already cut it and covered it with the ham like this. And if you like, you can cut it in the half or you can split in more parts. Okay, so here I have wheat flour. I'm going to add it here. Here you have two cups of wheat flour. And then I have here four whole eggs. Let's add it in another bowl. And with a fork, let's beat it like this until it's well combined, like this. And here I have Doritos. I'm gonna make a flower with these Doritos. With my hands, I'm gonna mash it like this. It's really easy to make, okay? And the quantity is to taste. It depends on how many snacks you want to do, okay? And guys, don't forget to tell us here in the comments where are you watching this video from so that I can send you a special hug on the next recipe. And I love to receive your comments. Tell me here in the comments, right? And guys, this recipe is really easy to make and the taste is incredible. Prepare it at home and I'm sure everyone will love it. You won't regret. We have all this cheese and the ham. Okay guys, so the Doritos are ready. So now, as you can see, it's like a flower, okay? It doesn't need to get like a flower very thin. This is okay for me. So now, let's pass our snack in the flour. Let's cover everything like this. And then, let's pass it through the eggs like this. And while I do that, I want to send a special hug to Tully Smith from South Africa. Thank you, my dear, for watching our videos and for following our recipes. It's a pleasure having you here with us. Now, guys, I'm going to repeat the process. I'm going to add it in the flour. Let's cover everything. And then I'm going to pass again in the eggs. This is going to help the cheese not to explode, okay? This is really important. Now let's add it in the egg, like this. And now in the Doritos, like this. Let's cover everything. And while I do that, why don't you tell me here in the comments what did you think about this recipe? You can rate from 1 to 10. I'd love to know your opinion. It's really important for me. And look here, guys. I covered everything with the Doritos. Like this. And now we just have to fry it. It's gonna be just like this. Here, 
I have hot oil, okay? I'm gonna add it in the oil, but you need to pay attention because if the oil is very hot, the cheese won't melt. So here it's not that hot, okay? It's important to have bubbles like this. We are going to fry it for a couple of minutes until it's golden brown. You're gonna see this is amazing. You can turn it to fry all the sides equally. It's important to have a golden brown color. You're gonna see this recipe is amazing. I like to do this every week. In my house, it's a huge success. My kids love it. Let's fry it for a couple of minutes and then we are going to take it off and put it in paper towel so that we can take off the oil excess. And it's ready when it's just like this, golden brown, right? And that's it guys, our snack is ready. It's very crunchy and delicious. Prepare it at home and I'm sure you won't regret. Everyone will love and will be surprised on how this recipe is made. Thank you guys for watching our videos and for following our recipes. It's a pleasure having you all here with us. Hope you enjoyed this recipe and now I'm gonna try this amazing dish. I see you in the next recipe. But first, let me show you the cheese on the inside. It's really delicious, isn't it? Hope you like this recipe and see you next time. Bye-bye!